Hey guys, I am back in Dollar Tree. And I just want to show you some of the things that they have out for Easter. These sports theme baskets. And look at this. Urban Outfitters has something very similar for $19 as a trash can. You just take the handles off and you have one for a dollar. So they have these other sports themed and some for Easter as well. They also have some Easter cards out. This one with the sloth with the bunny ears. And lots of candy. And I've not seen these before. Party cake peeps. Tons and tons and tons and tons and tons of Easter eggs. These are really cute. I haven't seen these before. They look like little dessert cups or cupcakes. And these that look like chocolate eggs. And then they have these with the little animal faces on them. Those are really adorable. And they have these larger ones with designs on them. You only get six in that one because they're the bigger ones. Lots of baskets. And these caught my eye. These are also like Easter eggs, but they're like pearlescent. If you plan to do any summer DIYs, you should grab a pack of those. You can use those in summer DIYs. They also have these cross containers if you don't want to use the Easter eggs. And behind those are these really pretty sort of metallic pearlescent Easter eggs. You have a lot of options this year. There's so many different types of Easter eggs or containers to use. They have these mermaid themed Easter baskets. These are fabric, the blue one and the pink one. They have these Easter eggs that look like little insects, ladybug, a bee and butterflies and some sports themed eggs that match the sports themed baskets and they have these flavored lip balms in peep flavors and I'm trying to show you that one right there it's cotton candy flavor this is the cutest little basket Really adorable. And I also like these little tins, the little bunny butt tin. And the rest of these just have um, different types of bunnies on them. Here are more Easter eggs. These are what I call inception eggs because they are eggs inside of eggs. You get six clear ones and six of the, I think they're little animals inside. So you get 12 pieces total. I think those are new this year. Look how cute these little bags are, these little gift bags. You get two for a dollar. And moving over to the florals, they brought these back. They sell out of these every single year. So if you see them, don't wait because they are definitely going to sell out of those. Lots of different greenery to choose from. These are all of the Buzzy Bee containers. And then they have these huge garden bags and I saw these high dome cloche and I'm just putting it next to the one that we're used to seeing so you can see how much taller it is also the base of it is black they brought back the lemon and lime packages three of each and lots of garden stakes cute little bee 
ladybug, happy little frog, and they have the butterfly. And this one, I think, is the cutest one, the little llama. Over in the school supply section, I found some notebooks with some cute little sayings on the front. this one as well. I think those are stickers. And look how cute these pins are. There's a purple and pink one in each packet. So you have the cats, the unicorns, and the koalas. Super adorable. And I'm just showing you guys they're starting to put things out for summer. So pool games and yard games, the pool noodles, all of that they're starting to put out as well as these styrofoam coolers. As you can see, they have a ton of them. I'm just trying to show you the size of them. They're not very big. You pay way more than a dollar for these at a grocery store. Here's some really cute pencil cases that you can put inside of a binder. These are sports themed. And I'm sorry if I jump around a little bit during the video. I'm kind of showing you guys the things that I found as I found them. But sometimes I had to double back because I didn't want to be piled up where there were a bunch of people. So I kind of just walked around and filmed what I could when there weren't too many people around. So if I seem to be bouncing back and forth between one thing and the next... I'm just trying to uh, keep a distance. Look at these pins, these little <laughs> monster pins. They're like little cyclop fuzzies. And they have the different ink inside of them. And they also had one in blue. Those were the only two that I saw. I'm sure they must have come in other colors. And I saw these new signs, and I did only see them in this blonde wood color. So there was the Bless This Nest home with the little flowers on each corner. And the This Is Us in blue. And the Thankful is the last one that I saw with the little ladybug in the corner. Next to those were these frames, which were new to my Dollar Tree, that have the little tag holder right there. Again, I did only see them in this color. And above that, I saw this new soy wax candle, coral reef, and this egg-shaped candle. Over by the pictures, I saw these glow-in-the-dark signs. I haven't seen these before. So they have the love you to the moon and back, the born to shine with the moon on it. And I found a few more over here. You are my sun and stars. I'm not sure how well the glow-in-the-dark work on these, so if you get these and you try it out, let me know. These would be great in a child's room. And here's some more little games, a uh, little bubble gun. And they also have more of the Barbie pets, the kitten and the puppy. And I'm really glad I don't collect Hot Wheels. These are some really cool looking Hot Wheels. Um, I think if I collected them, I would just spend so much money at Dollar Tree. Look at this one. It looks like it was made from Legos. It's called a Pixel Shaker. 
And they still have a lot of these career outfits for dolls. They have the vet, the doctor or nurse, the chef. I don't think I've seen this one before. The singer. And the last new one that I saw was uh, this one, the construction worker. I also saw the skin sugar tattoos, glitter tattoos. So there were three different packs. Each one came with a different color glitter and different stencils. So this one has pink and gold glitter. And then the blue package has blue and green glitter and different stencils, as you can see. And then this last one in the purple package has silver and purple glitter. And there are 50 little tattoos in each kit. And you get some bonus tattoos as well. Look at these new candle holders. They have it in clear. This one is my favorite, the amber colored. It's a light amber, but it's still like an amber color. This one's my favorite. And they also have it in this, like a smoky gray color. This gorgeous blue one. Really, really pretty. And they also have these little tea light candle holders. The clear one has a gold bottom. And these are very heavy too. The dark blue one has a dark blue bottom. The light blue one has a silver bottom. And then the last one is like this rosy one, which has a matching bottom. Guys, look at these Schwinn locks. So they're combo locks, and some of them have just the locks, and some of them have a lock and a little bonus light. Cute little ladybug. They have the turtle. So this is a light and lock set. And then the rest of these are just the lock. But Schwinn locks are pretty expensive, so to be able to get these for a dollar is a great find. Right next to them were these touchscreen gloves. So the tips of the fingers have the material that respond to smartphones and iPads and tablets. They have the neon color and then this one. And in between, they have these knit gloves, these jersey knit gloves. And I saw these new little burlap trim ribbon. Unfortunately, they are only two yards. But they have a few different patterns to choose from. They have the large cotton pods that come two in a pack and then the smaller ones where you get three in a pack and some more fabric roses. I used some of these in my last DIY. I will link it below if you have not already watched it. And then they have these galvanized metal signs. There's this one with the paw print, the star and the heart. Also, this vase right here was new. I haven't seen this before. It's so cute. I'm going to show you the info on it just in case you want to look it up. It's called a faceted glass vase or vase, whichever way you say it. <laughs> and then over here in the peel and stick section, this one caught my eye. Look at the cute ballerinas. They are so adorable. Really cute for a child's room. 
Very, very adorable. And this one with the mermaids on it. And they're all sparkly and glittery. Look how cute that turtle is. I also saw some new magnets. These were quite thick. Well, except this one. This one was broken, but you're supposed to be able to find five differences in that one. And here's more of the larger ones, sort of inspirational magnets. And then I wanted to show you guys these glass beads that look like candy or Fruit Loops or something. I've never seen those before. But if you get them, make sure you keep them away from kids because they look like candy. And in the dog section, they have two flavors of the Beggin Strips. Little in the smaller bags, of course. They still have lots of the Pet Bowl placemats in a few different colors. And these are folded over, so they're longer. And then they have that material on the back, the anti-skid material. And look at this. It's a little dog treat puzzle. The cheapest one of these that I've seen has been $20, so... To get this one for a dollar is a great deal. They also have some new chew toys, hashtag queen, fur boss, hashtag king. Can I have a tobacco, please? And then look at this one that looks like bark chips. <laughs> really cute. And then there's hashtag spoiled and pink and green. And there's this pizza slice. I'm pretty sure they must have had other ones because these are the only two. And they also have pet bowl mats for the little kitties in a few different colors as well. Also for the dogs, they have these ball launchers. Sorry, I'm going to turn my camera so you can see how long they are. So there was blue, pink, and yellow to choose from. And they also restocked the fish toys. These are supposed to be for cats, but I gave them to my dog and he liked them. And then farther down, they also have these little crinkle toys for cats that are shaped like little candy pieces. And I'm sure dogs would like those too anything that makes a noise and then I saw these glow-in-the-dark cable protectors so they have the little duck and the little dog I think and those were the only two that I saw I don't know how glow-in-the-dark they are but they're cute and they have some BBC DVDs on this one on the royal family guardians of the museum and also doctor who and they have this susan sarandon movie which was actually pretty funny and this collector's edition of this video about female pilots looks like it'd be interesting to watch these caught my eye as I was walking by. They're little earbud cases. And I did only find the one color. In the baby section, I saw that Beach Nut has some food out. There were three different flavors. The ingredients seem to be simple enough. So there were fruit flavors, two different fruit flavors, and then they had this breakfast flavor. And look at this. 
a hair dye comb. I've never dyed my hair, so I don't know how useful this would be. If you do dye your hair, do you think this would be useful? <laughs> they have the directions on it, so I don't know. But there were a ton of them out, so I think they just put them out. Bolero also has some alcohol-free body cleansing wipes. This is raspberry and fresh mint. They also have the citrus lime and tea tree oil and sweet orange and jojoba. And for face wipes, they have the grapefruit and lime. And they also have the hibiscus and lavender scent. Lots of pastel colors over in the beauty aisle. They also stocked this chubby stick from Flower Beauty. This was the only color that they had available. And this was new. I haven't seen this before. You can use it on your lashes to lift and separate them. And they also help your eyebrow hair to lay down. They have these Maybelline Color Jolt lip paints. And they did only have it in the stripped down color, which is a nude color. I found more magnets. <laughs> Let there be pizza on earth. And this one that says, I love you some more. Eat well, live simply, laugh often. And then these were some larger reversible magnets. So her turn, his turn, did my chores today. The other side says, I'll do it tomorrow. And then the one with the dogs, there's a dirty side. And, of course, on the other side is clean. And look how pretty these paper straws are in these pastel and gold colors. So pretty. And I saw these jars on an end cap. I haven't seen this shape before. They almost have a flat front and back. And I saw this Utopia peanut butter, which I have never seen before, but the ingredients seem to be pretty simple. So if you try it, let me know how it is. Over here in the snack cake section, I saw these new snacks from Korea. Peppero? I'm pretty sure I'm pronouncing that wrong. But it looks like just a cookie stick dipped in chocolate with almonds on it. it. Says it's Korea's number one brand. And over in the spring section, I saw this new bird seed for wild birds or bird food. But look at it. It looks like overnight oats smushed in a package or something. And on the round display, really the only new thing that I saw were these cross pictures or signs with different sayings on the hearts. A lot of this is the same stuff that we've seen before. The Easter egg candles, they bring those out every year and they still have lots of these trinket dishes. These are nice because they're a good size. And over here in the like party section, I guess. I saw these lampshade looking bowls, but ever since I flipped them over, I can only see them as a lampshade. <laughs> they also have these scalloped containers. Salsa flavored almonds. I've never heard of that, but I do know this brand. Um, I like their, this one here, the roasted salted almonds. They brought back the ginger ale drink mix. And they have a few different flavors of the hint water, but I haven't seen this one before with the caffeine in it. So they have two different flavors that have the caffeine kick to them. And then right above those were these Arrowhead Energy sparkling waters. 
So they do have caffeine in them, electrolytes, it's sparkling water, and 35 calories per container. Here are some more jars that I haven't seen before. You might want to scoop some of these up to do fall DIYs with because they look like little pumpkins. They also have these jars, and I got a couple of these because they're wide mouth jars. So they're perfect for me to make my overnight oats in. I don't have to struggle to get the spoon in and out. These are called embossed jars and they're nice because they come with a lid. And I saw the pine saw and then I saw the pink pine saw. I have not seen that before. Tropical flowers. So if you find the scent of regular pine saw a little too astringent, maybe this one might be better for you. They also have some of these containers. This store has the light gray ones and the charcoal gray ones. These are really nice guys. If you find these, grab them up. They also have the avocado tool where you use this part right here to remove, to cut the avocado, remove the pit and slice it with the top. And they have these spring cookie cutters. The great thing about this is you can use the round one to cut biscuits out as well. And they also have these Breton sesame crackers, which are really good. Okay, guys, that's going to be it for this walkthrough. I hope you enjoyed it. I hope you all are doing well, taking care and staying safe. I'll see you next time. Bye. Bye.